Hey y'all, it's Cup of Chi here with a nail video. Y'all, it's been a long time since I posted like a nail update. You know, one of those type of videos. These current nails I'm wearing are by Kiss. They're gel nails. Um, I've had them on for about 10 or 11 days. And as you see, they're starting to come off. So my nails from Amazon came in just in time. Um, I'm going to link these nails in the description box if you guys want to check them out. Um... And yeah, you're going to see me using my Bougie Blinks tweezer. You can find my girl on Instagram at Bougie Blinks. But anyway, um, if you are new here, my name is Chi. I've been wearing press-ons. Um, I want to say it was like the year that I turned 25. So since 24. And I'm currently 27. So do the math. Um, yeah, I've been wearing press-ons for a good little minute. At first, I was using the glue that comes with the press-ons, but I noticed that they were not sticking like I wanted them to. And my whole point of going to press-ons was to save money at the nail shop because I like to have my nails done, but the nail shop costs a lot of money, damages your nails, and uh, contrary to belief, my technique has not damaged my nails yet. So, I'm showing y'all these nails. I think they come with 500 pieces and four things of nail glue. But, you guys know, I don't use the regular nail glue. So, um, yeah. I started using Gorilla Glue. I can't remember when. And, um, I recorded two videos, I think, about the Gorilla Glue. And since then those videos have been like the most popular videos on my channel which is so funny because people were like going off of the comments <laughs> but i still want to thank y'all for watching seriously i feel like those videos grew my channel um but i'm showing you guys i use my technique of hot water soap oil to get some of the nails off um i have two stubborn nails left so, I was showing you guys this. If you want to watch a more detailed video of how I remove my acrylics, then I will link that video in the description box as well. But as you guys see, my nails are still pretty healthy. Um, if you see them shaped a little weird, sometimes when I'm wearing coffin nails, I kind of shape them going inwards. Just because with press on, sometimes you have to kind of go down on the nail size. And so, I don't want my nails poking out. So you'll see some of those nails poking, some of those nails, I'm sorry, um, being shaped like weird, I guess, shaped like a triangle. And that's the reason why. Okay, so I'm just showing you guys my nails. All of them are off. All of them are pretty healthy, pretty long, pretty strong. This is how we're coming. Okay, so here's my little setup. I'm trying this new um, little kit from, I think, Sally Hansen to decorate my nails. Um, so, as you guys see, I have my nail polishes. I'm going to do some Kwanzaa-themed nails. I'm putting Kwanzaa in quotations <laughs> um, because I'm not a nail tech. I can't really decorate. But here's the secret ingredient, you guys, the Gorilla Glue. Gorilla Glue has been the key ingredient to Sanchez's cheese nails for all of these years. Um, I was making a disclaimer as I was recording this. I am not a professional. Try this at your own risk. I'm only recording my experience with nail with Gorilla Glue. And thank you for watching. So right here, I got off topic. I just wanted to put y'all on really quick. Um, I know all the girls love NYX Butter Gloss. I do too. But sometimes you can't get your hands on those because they're always sold out. I was putting you guys on. Go to your local hair store. Get Ruby Kisses Butter Balm Gloss. I promise you, it is a dupe, you guys. I have three different colors. One is out. I was just showing you guys the perfect nudes. Um, I also have a pink as well, but I didn't feel like going to go get it. But, yeah, this was just me putting you guys on to a NYX Butter Gloss dupe. It's called Ruby Kisses. Okay, so I'm just showing you guys. I have my nail, my nail clippers, my cuticle pusher. Um, and make sure that you buff your nails out so that they can be a little dry so that the glue can stick better. 
So I've applied the nails, y'all. They are pretty long. <laughs> I'm not really a nail, a long nail wearing girl, but um, this is what they look like. Sometimes my application becomes a little messy, but that's okay. So as you see here, I've painted the nails. They are very messy. However, I like to clean up at the end. Um, yeah, I'm just showing you guys. Look how long they are. I'm definitely going to clip these down. Um, maybe after I get my pictures and stuff. Because I usually don't wear my nails this long. But for all the girls who love long nails, these are the perfect nails. Perfect shape. They are very sturdy. So I would definitely recommend. I wanted to show y'all that I got some jewelry from Lisa. Accessories and jewelry, a black on business that I found on Instagram. So this is the finished product. I am satisfied by the way that they turned out, y'all. Look at my little design. I want to get better at designing, mark my words. But, yeah, I'm very satisfied. Tell me what you guys think. I would definitely recommend these nails. Y'all can probably see I got a little glue underneath on my fingers and stuff. But that's okay with me. Um, So, yeah, tell me what you guys think. I want to thank y'all for watching. Please subscribe if you have not done so. We are on the way to 1K. And you guys have a nice day. See y'all next time. Bye-bye.